on a big spread, if you have a lot of different foods there besides the turkey, which we often do, there could be some red meats or some uh, heavier foods there. And this is where I recommend the Cabernet Sauvignon. Another good wine that goes with some of the, the meatier foods is a Pinot. Pinot is a very versatile red wine as well. You want to get something with a lot of flavor, but it's also very smooth and very drinkable and food friendly. So when you're pairing wine with food, you want something that complements the food and doesn't overwhelm it. So you don't want something that's too sweet or too dry or too acidic. You want something that is smooth on the front end, on the back end, and that actually complements the food and makes it taste better. Now, finally, you finish the main meal and everybody's sitting around stuffed like a turkey, you know the feeling, but dessert is coming out. So if you're having it with coffee, great. If you want to continue the meal with a small glass of wine, people sometimes will drink a small port. Um, you can have a nice white wine with a light cake, like a lemon cake or a white chocolate. At one of our wine events, a chef paired our Chardonnay with a white chocolate cake, and it was actually amazing. So this would go with the, the light desserts. If you're gonna eat something heavier, like uh, a chocolate dish, uh, the cab is a really good choice. And again, you might be able to pair a Pinot or even with something that's kind of juicier, uh, maybe a, like a tart, you might pair the, the rosé. So you can go back to all three of these wines depending on the, the dessert that you're serving and continue serving wine and having a great time.